Guys, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to design a birthday flyer like this using Adobe Photoshop. If you are old yet, thanks. And if you are new here, please kindly subscribe and turn on the notification bell to get notified anytime I upload a new video. So, without any further ado, let's get started. So, this is our Photoshop. After launching it, then you go to a file then uh, and uh, here we are going to make use of 1080 by 1080 pixels leave your resolution at 300 and grid your designing background then we are going to bring our resource file and import this background okay then i'm going to scale it out a little Okay, go to your resource file and import this background, then scale it out. Then change the blending mode to screen. Now import this palm tree. Reduce the size. Flip it horizontal. You drag it to the top corner here by the left. Then we are going to blow it. Select your Gaussian blow. And over here, we are going to make use of 5.4%. Now, this is the image we are going to use in this tutorial. Then select your subject here that is quick subject and select the subject to remove the background now apply your layer mask we are going to convert it to smart subject now drag it to the other side where you are working reposition it Duplicate this one, turn it off, come back to the first one, then apply black and white effects. Now follow this setting here. So this one I'm going to reduce it to 31%. And the second one I'm going to reduce this one around eight percent leave this one at 40 percent also leave this one 60 percent then this one i'm going to add one percent making it 21 percent and this one i'm going to change this one to 79 percent all right then create a clipping mask so that the effect will only affect the image. Then reduce the opacity. All right, so click like this. So the next thing, turn this one on. Then drag it to this position. And we are going to flip it horizontal. Okay. So now use your arrow key then to arrange it properly. And I'm going to position it like this. It's okay. Then use your arrow key again to centralize it. Then apply this background, reduce the image size. Then change the blending mode to soft lights 
apply your layer mask select your gradient tool and blend the bottom here then adjust it a little So the next, I'm going to apply this abstract background, bring it down, select your layer mask. Now, pick your gradient tool and blend it. Now, also import this background. And increase the size go to your blending mode and change it to screen then apply this glow in effect then position it around there up here will be okay then change it to screen something like this is okay okay now then apply your test now so take note that this image i'm not going to include this image in the resource file so you can get any image from Google. If you are watching this video and you are not subscribed yet, please subscribe and turn on the bell so that you will get notified anytime I upload a new video. Then reduce the font size. Then go to select, select all. Then apply center alignment. Then and go to select, deselect. Okay, something like this. So the next, we are going to copy our test. We make a copy of this one, Ctrl plus C to copy. Then duplicate this one, Ctrl plus J to duplicate, or you drag it over here. Now bring it down. Select your test tool or using the shortcut T. Now we are going to close the character space in there to zero percent. The control plus V to paste. Then I'm going to change this font color here. Then enter this code here b 9 e 1 0 to centralize the test then go to select select all apply center alignment then go back to select and deselect Copy this one, Ctrl plus C to copy. Then select your test tool or using T on your keyboard. And we are going to change the font here. So the font I'm using here is Tisha. Ctrl plus V to paste. Then 
Now increase the font size. Reduce it a little more. So okay like this. Then duplicate the test and drag it over here. Select your test tool, highlight it, Ctrl plus V to paste. Increase the size. All right. Then bring it down over here. So import this star, reduce the size, then position it at the right corner over here. So let it be around here. Now rotate it a little. That's okay. Then apply blur, Gaussian blur. And we are going to make it 7.6 percent okay then duplicate it ctrl plus j to duplicate and position it over here or any other places you may like Then select your rent angle to we are going to draw a little rent angle at the top here. Duplicate it. Right, so I light it again and merge it together. Reduce the opacity. So we leave it at 19%. Then select it and reduce the size. So that is all about this tutorial. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and uh, share. So if you need any of my flyer, then you can go to my Fiverr account and make your order. So thank you so much for watching. Please do remember to subscribe and share.